Now a few years ago I discovered 3D printing. Back then it was really not accessible for the average home user, you know printers were quite expensive still in the thousands of dollars range uh, and nonetheless I, I found it quite intriguing I wanted to have uh, learned a bit more about it so I spent a few years researching and watch YouTube videos, people online, uh, reviews to get a bit of an understanding on how it's going, what's going on with the, the, with the industry uh, and, and over the years of course it eventually became cheaper and um, people started to develop kits and um, eventually I bought my own and uh, originally I wasn't I didn't want to buy one until I knew that I'd have a reason to use it or an excuse to use it so to speak uh, and eventually I understood that there were opportunities with the car stuff that I was doing where I could use the 3d printer uh, and one application which I wanted to show you today is something a little bit a uh, little bit different but nonetheless still quite interesting and so On my car, I don't run door mirrors, um, and that's just purely because, I don't know, they're weight and drag, and who needs that? Uh, and so, normally there's a blanking, a hole here, and so, you remove the uh, the door mirror, there's wires and things that go through to control the electronics in them, uh, and so I blanked it off, and I 3D printed this little cover plate. And so, you know, a few minutes on the computer uh, to design it up, get the right dimensions, put my name on it for uh, shits and giggles, uh, and then, you know, an hour or so on the printer and you've got this sort of result, something that you created yourself that was designed by me uh, and it's quite a neat result. You know, I could have, well, previously I was just running a bit of cut out aluminium. It looked, it worked, but it didn't look as good. This kind of has this neat look to it and of course you can make the both sides look exactly the same. And so I guess, you know, it's kind of cool, isn't it? That you can do these things all by yourself at home create something from absolutely nothing and it creates this uh, very neat result anyway that's just a quick video I want to show you some of the little things that I do on the car probably why things take quite so long sometimes anyway thank you very much for watching we'll see you next time